Hey, what's going on my fellow gamers? Figgity Figgity Fox here. Before we get too far into it, remember to hit that like button if you enjoy Silent Hill. Subscribe if you're not subscribed yet for more Silent Hill content because I will be doing a complete LP of this. And uh, share the video around a little bit if you don't mind. Help get some exposure out there for the channel. I'd greatly appreciate it. But now that that's out of the way, let's continue on our merry way. Did we actually go through the store yet? I don't think we did. Where are we? Down here. Let's go through this door. It's locked. Okay, we're not going through that door. That's not happening. Maybe we can go through this door. It's locked. Well, it has made our choice very clear for us where we're going. We're going through these double doors. Into the courtyard. Wait, did we go through the wrong double doors? Yeah, we did. <laughs> okay this time for real into the courtyard right, right, right. fuck you now I remember these things were supposed to be like um, children or whatever and they, they changed it to just be kind of like weird looking aliens I guess you'd say because, you know, shooting shooting children was a bit too much, I guess. <laughs> Def fucked up creatures. It, it sounds like there's another one, and I don't know where it is. So I guess for now we're going to ignore it. Whoa! You fucking creepy little bastard snuck right up on me. Oh, you automatically aim down. Wow. Alright. Uh, how is our health? Are we, are we in a different color yet? No, we're still green. Okay. Well, perhaps we actually could have played this on, on normal. I really didn't expect it to... Um, I was really worried about the controls, basically. I was worried that we were going to have an extremely hard time. And we're not having as hard of a time as I thought we were going to. This door is jammed. It cannot be opened. We'll go with this one. Alright, so we can't go through here. Which, what door did we not check? I kind of want to go back and check it now. Just to... So it looks like it's the door that leads us out into the back of the school, maybe? Let's try it and see where it takes us. I know you're in here somewhere. I can hear you, obviously. What the f What the fuck? Um... Oh, okay, I, I guess you guys aren't dangerous. Right, this door is jammed and can't be opened. I forgot. I completely forgot about them things. I, I don't know if they become dangerous later on or but if they're, if they're just there. I don't even know what they are. I guess a little ghost creature babies. What's this say? A friend in need. Okay. That, that guy does not look like a friend in need. That's, that's an evil looking picture. <laughs> Should I fix the camera here? There we go. And we'll be doing the typical Silent Hill thing, which is checking each room one by one and checking the map a lot. So we can unlock this. Alright, that's unlocked now. Storage jammed and cannot be opened. We can go in the bathroom, however. And take that, you fucking gray alien creature thing. I don't actually know what they're supposed to be now. I could probably look it up and find out. Was that all there was in here? Apparently so. Alright. But by the time I actually look it up and find out, you know, I will have finish this section and it won't matter anymore. 
So yeah, nothing in the bathrooms. At least not yet. Maybe later. So we've checked all the doors on this side, right? Yes. So now we have a choice either to go down or up. I'm gonna choose to go down first. Because I'm pretty sure that there's look how fucking tiny these doors are. Oh, nothing inside. I, I can't even go down. So that's fine. We go up first. That makes our options even easier. Also, another thing I noticed, again, sorry, I'm comparing this to Resident Evil Director's Cut, but I literally, you know, it's, I'm maybe playing this a week after I finished playing Resident Evil Director's Cut, so it's still fresh in my mind, but you don't have to click on the stairs to go up the stairs. You just go up the stairs, like in Resident Evil 3. I want this. Even though I'll probably never fucking need them. Which, again, I, I really didn't think it would be this easy. Although, we did say we're here for the story, so... Really, the difficulty of the game does not matter that much. Because I don't recall the story to this game. Like I said, I only really recall getting to the basement of this place. And I th think... I'm not sure, but I think I beat the beast that was down there. Which... Oh, look at that. Map of the U.S. Which is, um, yeah, as far as I've gotten in this game that I can recall. So anything beyond that point is new. And even before we even get to that point, I mean, there's a lot of stuff here that's still new because I just want to go in and out of these doors. That way they're, they're marked on the map. I know it's stupid, but... Part of the process. Wrong button. Still getting used to the controls. Alright, so, oh, there's, um, I can't believe we didn't try the doors back there. I suppose we should turn around and try these double doors before we go further down the hall. Wee, too far. Wow, we can actually go in here. Alright. We got some creepy music again. The fuck is that? That's fucking creepy. What is that? It, it, it's, it's just the music. There's nothing in here. See, here I am thinking there's a fucking monster in here. And it's just the music. <laughs> fucking kudos game kudos there silence silencio nothing useful What the fuck? A hand. Statue of an old man's hand. Wait a second. Didn't we just pick up chemical? Wonder if the chemical could melt the hand away. It can. All right. So we got the gold medallion. So we got one out of, I'm guessing two, because the other medallion is a silver medallion. So I'm fucking moving just in case there's a silver one. No, there wasn't. Okay. Still, now, now I'm being wary of them things traveling in packs. <laughs> All right, that door is locked. Uh, can we get around? Any way to get around? There is, if we go through the library, and that's a res uh, reserved library. So, through here. Wait, what, what is this? This is first aid kit? Yes, it is. 
Alright, I know you're around here somewhere. You must be on the other side of this. Oh, it's just you guys. You fucking sneaky motherfucker. Yeah, I can actually just walk right through you guys. You guys cause no harm at all. You're just there for the... The spooks. Just to make me think something bad's gonna happen. Is this the right door? I just wanna check. Yes, it is. Alright, let's do it. More squeakers, or... What are we dealing with here? Not a squeaker! Whoops. Panic hit a bunch of buttons to try to kick it off me. Are you dead? Put a lot of bullets in you. <laughs> what was the point of coming in here? Anything? Maybe there'll be a point later on. I don't know. Maybe this room has no point. Maybe the point of coming in here was to waste my time. Which, you know, hey, that's... It's good good to have uh, rooms that have nothing in them. I mean... Maybe that room will serve a purpose later on. We don't know. Uh, because it did give us different times. So, once times change, then... You know, what's what's in a certain area could be different than what it was before. Creepy ass fucking music, man. I love it. Well, it's not it's not really music. It's more like ambient noise. But still. All right, so we'll go out. Go back in. <laughs> then go through here. Go down. Oh crap, there's one one. Where are you? There you are. Can't hit you from here. No, I can. You gotta kind of be in my line of sight for me to actually hit you. There. Take it now. Take it down like a true champion. I got a feeling there's some out here in the hall. Oh, you fucker! I, God damn, I knew it. Knew it, knew it, knew it, knew it, knew it. Thank you for ignoring me while I slaughtered your friend. I appreciate it. I, I appreciate your, uh, your cooperation in the matter. Are you alive? You're not alive. So where's the static coming from? Something's alive. Alright, so... Where is that coming from? Oh, it's you. Little creepy ghost baby. You just like to walk around and mess with us. That's pretty much it, right? That's all you do? Yeah, that's all you're doing. You're just walking around messing with us. Alright. I guess we'll go through here, see if we can get to the music room and whatnot. That is not a ghost baby. One at a time. Good night. I remember this. This scared the absolute fuck out of me when I was younger. <laughs> just a cat. Of course, how the fuck did that cat get in there? But still. Just a cat. And then you hear that. It's like, really? We, we, we just basically sent the cat off to be murdered by something. There's nothing inside. Oh, 
we, we ran in a circle. My bad. Sorry. Brain stopped for a minute there. One, two, three. You're down. And four. Switch this. Switch the view. So, I, I think the only reason to go in there was to free the cat. And I guess uh, later on, you know, we'll, we'll have a reason to have gone in there. Just like... I don't think this room has a purpose right now. It won't open. Odd. Doesn't seem to look locked though. It's written in blood. I, I won't need to know that though until I can actually use the peony. The piano. Yeah, it still won't open. Alright, so we don't have to worry about that right now because, well, we, we can't open that right now, so. Are we at the opposite side now? We are. So it, it's locked? I, I was not expecting that. I expected we'd be able to unlock it. <laughs> oh, you little squeaker. Ah, music. I love it. Alright, so, the one that's locked, it didn't say it was locked from the other side, it just said it was locked. Now, I'm going to actually go in there and try to open it from this side, just for the hell of it, because it's not going to take us that long to do it. There it is right there. There, now it's unlocked. Alright, so now we can go through that way. Uh, for now, we will go upstairs because we can't do anything more down here. So let's head on up. I should actually probably end this video here now I'm thinking about it. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, once again, make sure and hit that like button for me. If you're not subscribed yet and you want to see more daily content or just more Silent Hill content, make sure to subscribe and ring that little bell. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a video and you'll never miss a thing. And if you don't mind sharing the video around a little bit, I would greatly appreciate it and it would definitely help the channel grow. But as always, until next time, take care my fellow gamers.